General of the Army Omar Bradley, 88, was buried with Heroes Honors in Arlington National Cemetery today and eulogized by Major General Francis Sampson, retired Chief Army Chaplain who landed in Normandy with him. Jim McManus reports. He was General of the Army Omar Nelson Bradley. At the National Cathedral, they recalled he was a poor boy from Clark, Missouri, who went to West Point. During World War II, he rose from an obscure lieutenant colonel to wear four stars and command more than a million men in Europe. Because of his deep concern for the ordinary soldier, he was known as the G.I.'s general. He is the soldier's general, and indeed he preferred the title the soldier soldier because he bore that responsibility with enormous energy and determination. Among the honorary pallbearers, old soldiers, William Westmoreland, Andrew Goodpaster, J. Lawton Collins, and an old friend, entertainer Bob Hope. General Bradley's casket was borne across Memorial Bridge by Quezon, the riderless horse Majestic Kid following. Air Force jet fighters roared a salute. The caisson stopped in bright sunshine on a hill in Arlington National Cemetery overlooking the Potomac. The general's wife, Mrs. Kitty Bradley, tearfully accepted the flag that had draped his casket. He was Omar Bradley, last of the five-star generals, his flag now retired. Jim McManus, CBS News, Arlington National Cemetery.